uh, Jesus is the God man. We present to you a Rome Productions. What's good everybody? If you're a first time viewing my content and of this video, make sure you like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to be watching a video that I just surprisingly and randomly ran across on uh, <laughs> TikTok. And it was this live stream between this white man who is a pastor and this black man who I don't particularly know what he identifies with. But he has uh, the Ankh and uh, Ma'at in his symbol in his uh profile anyways he's having this back and forth debate with this pastor we're going to talk about it i don't i don't really thought i don't really think he he held himself up um then again i wasn't there for the whole debate so i don't really know what happened throughout the whole debate but i was there long enough to see them have this interaction and so i clipped it and watch for probably about a minute and a half of it so let's get into it. Yeah, Jesus is the God man. Jesus is the God man. Okay. So, what the? Okay, so if Jesus, <laughs> if, if Jesus is a God man, what makes you believe that you are not God man? Because I'm not <laughs> God. The the, the gold <laughs> spirit of humility and common sense. I'm not God. I can't. Think Jesus, I can't rise myself to the dead like he could. Jesus came to earth in the form of man. He has always existed before then. We have him in the Old Testament. We call him Theophanes. He was uh, a lot of times depicted as the angel of the Lord. And the reason we know it was him in the Old Testament is because he would appear before people. People would bow down and worship him, and he would not stop them. He would accept their worship. Okay, Jesus was never meant to be worshipped. Jesus was meant to yes. be followed he was meant jesus, to uh, the the whole message of jesus was to uh, say you can be just like me it was uh, never to worship don't even him and what the bible says about jesus but then you're gonna sit here and i don't have perfect. to i don't have to because you don't, you don't why know. would why jesus, would why would this is the god man would, jesus came to earth in the form of man to be a sacrifice for sin romans 6 23 says for the wages of sin is death for the wages of sin is death, so, but the gift of God is eternal. So, so okay, because so, of our sin, so, so there had to be that people need to be saved. Dead. So you think Jesus that people need to, to be saved? Do what? So you think that people need to be saved? Yes, absolutely. They need to be saved from their sin. Turn away and repent from your sin. Yep. I don't think people need to be saved by Jesus. People need to save themselves. It's like kind of drowning in a four foot pool, not knowing you can no. stand up is drowning in a four foot pool you trying to save yourself thinking that you're good enough and a good enough person to save yourself is where you're very very wrong let me just say when i saw a comment that said i'm on the wrong side of tiktok i felt that way too because <laughs> ain't no way i'm on tiktok and i see this there's no there's just there's no possible way I'm over here just minding my business on TikTok and I run across this and I see this on TikTok. And shout out to the man, I don't know particularly what his name is, Immortal Zen 5. I didn't feel like he held his ground on it. I only say that because near the end of it, they was talking about how, uh, they were talking about Christ's resurrection. And Red the Pastor was like, you know, I believe in Christ because Christ rose from the dead. And he was like, you know, uh, immortal. I believe he was talking about how, like, how, you know, Jesus is the only way. And so Red was like, you know, did the Muhammad rose, you know, and immortal was like, well, there's many Muhammad's. I didn't feel like it was a good comeback. Uh, <laughs> I would have I already immediately initiated into where's Jesus, you know, well, what well, Jesus ain't here because he rose from the But is he coming back, though? He is like a thief into the night. It tells you in the book of the Bible cannot be used for evidence of a person that you have never seen. You never heard from. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> you can't have a personal relationship with somebody you've never seen or heard from. It's just not possible. 
even for people who have long distance relationships, at least we are negotiating and communicating through a phone and I can hear you. I can see you when I talk to you, you respond back directly, not in the midst, not not something falling down from a tree, not a sunny day turning into a rainy day. Not my flat tire. There's no spookism here. <laughs> There's no hocus pocus going on here. When I talk to somebody, I get a response back. When I call somebody on the phone, I get a response back. I don't have no time. I'm over here on my knees trying to wait for God. Oh, he, he, he talks in many different ways. Let's establish first and foremost that he said that Jesus is the God man. Now, if Jesus is the God man then that would mean that we are also God man, right? Now, he said that Jesus is God that manifested himself in the form of a human. With that being the case, we will also have to say that Adam, the first Adam, would be God manifested in the flesh. Eve is God manifested in the flesh. Everything that God has created is manifested in his image and likeness. With that being said, not only is Jesus the God man, but you yourself are the God. Well, can't speak for red here. Um, he has some other issues going on with him, but <laughs> for us, the original people, we are God manifested in the flesh. Everything about our whole being, from our genetic makeup to the coils of our hair, we replicate the universe. Now, I won't touch up particularly on how he talks about how Jesus was basically an angel of the Lord. Um, there is no biblical or, or any type of evidence to prove that Jesus was the angel of the Lord. And he was, work he was working as a messenger beforehand. Let's backtrack a little bit. Jesus told his disciples that the works I do, you do also in greater. Tells you in the book of Romans that you are not only heirs of God, but co-heirs with Christ. The same birthright Christ had, you had. Now you just have access to that which is within you because Christ showed you the example. Now you're not supposed to follow Jesus. You're supposed to follow the Christ. I thought Jesus was the Christ. He was. But he was dressed a Christ. You also can be the Christ. Christ is a consciousness. It's not a person. It's a title. Just the same thing as Buddha. Buddha is a title. But it's a title to represent the consciousness that a person has. Now another thing I didn't like is, is that Immortal said that he don't have to read the Bible or to know the Bible to understand the character of Jesus. Yes, you do. <laughs> I can't understand Greek mythology unless I read some form of, of passage somewhere in a book or, or somewhere else in about about Zeus and Apollo and Hera and Heracles. I have to read it for myself to understand these characters. I can't just hear about it in church. No, I have to read it for myself and study it for myself. I want you to understand that you are God manifested in the flesh. However you want to interpret it. God, Allah, Brahma, Atman, uh, Amun, Amun Ra. However you want to interpret it, however you want to call it, El, Elohim. Understand that you are all of that manifested in the flesh. Understand that all of these mythologies were inspired by the anatomy and the alchemy of the body of man. So everything that is happening in these scripts and in the Vedas and in the Quran and all this other type of stuff, this has been happening within the body. The hero's journey, not only just happening within the body, but it also happens within the seasons, within the changes of time. All of this is inspired by the things that happen as above, so below, as within, so without. But share your thoughts concerning the whole matters at hand in the comment section below. Until next time, I am Tyrone. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and share this video with other people. Until next time, again, I'm Tyrone, and I am...
It's just me, myself, and I. Ride it, no, no, hit me up, might not reply. Feeling focused, got my optics on the light. Feel on the prize, you come for mine. Go suicide, I pay the price. It's just me, myself, and I. Ride it, no, no, hit me up, might not reply. Feeling focused, got my optics on the light. Feel on the prize, you come for mine. Go suicide, I pay the price. Hey.